New research has found that these cute critters here may be the reason why people in medieval England got leprosy. Scientists have found by doing analysis on red squirrel bones and human remains and found that both the red squirrel and human remains had the same features, indicating that the same bacteria had gotten into both the red squirrel and the humans. So it is believed that red squirrels may be one of the causes as to why humans in medieval England got leprosy. It is believed it is in connection to the fur trade. Dr. Sarah Inskap, I'm hoping I'm pronouncing her last name right, said finding leprosy in modern squirrels was a surprise. They've also said this is the first time that a modern animal has been used to identify a disease from the past. So this discovery is actually really fascinating. I hope to find out more about this sort of stuff, but yeah, I just thought I'd share this with you. I literally just heard it on the radio talking about how red squirrels, those cute little critters, not only did they try and wipe out the grey squirrels, but they're also trying to wipe out humans.